Greetings, Greg here with my Nintendo Switch and the Joy-Con grip. We are going to fire up Snake Pass. It just came out today. So let's go ahead and see what that's all about. We're going to play it for the first time. I have uh, never seen it. I've never turned it on. I've never played it. We're going to find out what it's like for you to turn it on and play it for the first time. And it's very loud in my ear. So I'm going to go ahead and adjust that. First things first, I see the Unreal Engine. Super cool to see that boot up on Switch. Um, that's a pretty important thing that we're getting, Unreal. <clears throat> Please don't turn off your Switch while it's saving, because that would be poop. Oh, look, yay. Custom thumbnail. Bum, 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 bum. Adjust the settings until Snake Pass logo is barely visible. Oh man, on my TV it's so bright. My monitor, though, it's totally different, so I'm not sure what I should do. Wow. Barely visible on my streaming monitor. Uh, super visible on my TV, so I need to make some adjustments to my TV. But we're going to leave it at that, and we're going to choose a new game. This is so snappy and colorful. I like it. Mm -mm -mm. Grip. Move forward. Change camera. Center camera. Dive, tail grab, lift head, move head, change. <laughs> oh my god. First off, let's chill that music so you guys can hear me, okay? Audio mix, TV, headphones, speakers. Oh, nice. Um, headphones. That's the first Switch game I've seen so far with uh, that kind of option. Uh, here we go. We're going to start in Paradise, what did it say? Paradise something, I don't know. Use the grip button to hold on tight. I believe that was a ZL, something like that. And we have some shaky shaky going on. We're meeting a hummingbird. Hello, Mr. Hummingbird. Noodle, oh, his name is Noodle. We're taking a little nap. We have to wake up. He's going to wake us up. Noodle, something's wrong. We're Noodle. Oh, he's kind of cute. We have to fix the gate or we'll be stuck here forever. Oh my god, you move with ZR. I can never remember um, what ZR is. <laughs> or ZL. Z I used to remember, you know? On a Nintendo 64. Oh my god. This is going to be hard. Hey, they said he absorbed this stuff and didn't eat it and make the bump in his body, but I'm seeing the bump in his body. In the early videos I saw, that was not happening, but it is now. Oh shit. What am I doing? So I'm collecting these blue things by slithering. Lift your head by holding A. Of course. Not like move the controller. Hold A. Uh, Alright, so far so good. Alright, what if I want to lift my head and go up and around this? I mean, I saw a video today of the developer playing. And he made it look so easy to like wrap yourself around this stuff. And I can tell you right now. No. Ah. Very nice. Mm-hmm. Oh, I'm gonna stop pressing A. That's what it is. Uh-huh. Oh, he's happy now. This is really hard. Um, what's that? Did I press something? What happened? <clears throat> A keystone is missing. Ah, we have to get it. And bring it back. Okay. So there you go. We have a mission. We have a goal. I have to slither this snake that just won't freaking move. And pick up that green thing. So I'm holding the this trigger down the whole time. 
and just kind of back and forthing on the controller. And that's what's making him do his little move. And we want to get that. So we're going to go ahead and reach up there. Somehow. Uh, I can't do it. Um. All right, we're gonna. No idea what to do, so let's go ahead and get something else instead. Let's get this little red one. Oh. Yay. Now maybe we can go ahead to the that red light there and see what happens. Put you down for one second. Okay, I'm back, my bad. <clears throat> and in here we go. Do we have to like wrap our whole self up? In there? Kinda sorta. Oh my god, it says I missed one. Can I go back and like get it? Alright, now we can go apparently to Courtyard Clamber or go back there and get the 20th one. Uh, which I kinda want. Let's check the next one. I did so poorly the first time around, I stopped the video in the middle of this level. But I think... I think I can get us through it now. Let's go. Alright, here we go. We're gonna slither... Don't fall off the level. Oh, they're gone. There's the green one. Okay. I thought it was somewhere else, but it's not. It's, it's not. Up we go. Up we go. Sometimes you have to put your head down to, like, make that next wrap, you know? You don't need to give me a lift. I got it. I'm good. I'm just looking for those, you know, other colors. Oh, I can't make it over that wall. So we're going to slither our way over here. So far, there's nothing to pick up. Oh, there's yellow. There's a checkpoint. I believe if we go left... We fall off the level. Oh, they're all missing. We have to get them. Oh, here they are. I think I went the wrong way or something. It seemed like I went around the whole level, didn't it? He's just telling me now I should get these things. I mean, it seemed pretty obvious to me, but let's go get the first one. There it is. Mm -mm, mm -mm, Slytherin. I guess I'm supposed to chill and relax, but, you know, I grew up on Super Mario. I want to dive my ass up there and get that shiz, you know? Oh, oh I like his little facial reactions. So I'm going to give him credit. Plus one on that. All right. So let's go up here. And let's just make a simple slither. That was easy. Um, all right. Now my biggest fear is falling off the level. Because it restarts you, and the camera is not clear. Like, it's not clear where the level ends. You can't really see it until you've already, you know, walked off of it like an idiot. So there's the green one. I guess the level becomes a little more fun once you kind of know where things are. That's done. This level is out of here. This level is horse manure. Off we go. Where's the gate? Piece of cake. Just slithering back and forth with the controller. Um, this is gonna get old, I can tell you right now. The back and forth thing. I wish he could just, you know, walk on his own. But whatever. Drop it in. That's right. Raising the roof. Humming bees raising the roof. Mm-hmm. 
Mm hmm Go snakey. Go snakey. Yep. Now here's the fun part. You gotta get all the way in here or he won't take you. Like, just won't. There it is. I'm in. Word, y'all. Word. Yay. Good. I did stupendous. According to the blue dots that I didn't collect, I did shitty. But that's okay. Whatever. On to level three. <clears throat> okay, so... After uh, turning off the last level, uh, in my next attempt, I immediately, immediately, immediately cleared the level, like in two seconds flat. So, I decided I'm going to go ahead and try one more time to record a level. This is level three. up here. It says uh, press the ZL button to uh, tighten your grip and uh, I haven't seen that work yet. I press ZL and absolutely nothing happens. Uh, there was a bug. He should have ate it. Okay, where is the next coin? Not coin, but you know, uh, green thing. Oh, I saw a developer play this level. He was just so slick and whatnot. <laughs> Even went down that slide. Let's go ahead and get that yellow one. Maybe I'm rushing, you know, maybe you can just like take your time when you play this game. Maybe like just move a little more slowly and more methodically. Tighten your grip by holding ZL. I have not seen ZL do anything. I press it and nothing happens. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You're good. You got this. You got this climb. Uh huh. Uh huh. Get that. Get that. Go ahead. Whoa. I got the bird holding my tail. It seems to be a nice way to get certain things done. So there's two. Let's uh, slither our way here. And let's hope that I don't accidentally walk off the level because when you do it uh makes you start over at the checkpoint no matter what tedious items you've collected and that for a game that's supposed to be like casual like this that's a, just a huge mistake huge 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 no no because it just adds so much stress uh to the game because now you can't just casually play and roam around and experiment and go after the hard blue things. You had to make decisions. Because if you die, he keeps telling me to press ZL. ZL does nothing. I'm not pressing ZL. Sorry, kid. Sorry, little bird. We're gonna slither up here. We're gonna just slither. I'm gonna knot out of myself there. That was fun. Um, okay, I'm trying to pretend that I don't absolutely hate this game. And it's ridiculously awful controls. And the fact that I just suck at them. Alright. Here we go. If it tells me to press ZL one more time, I'm going to kill myself. Because I've pressed ZL repeatedly. And it just continues to tell me that I should press ZL. We're going to do this. We're going to do this. Yep, yep, I know. I know you dumbass. There he is. There it is. Nice. And that was a checkpoint there, which is interesting. Because I'm done with this level. So let's go down here. Since I saw a developer do it, I should do it too. That just makes sense. Off he goes. And I missed that jump. So let's go ahead and finish this level before I accidentally fall off. Maybe I will replay level 2. Um, so you can see me not suck. So there's level three. He drops off all those things. And we go here and we... You gotta bunch in real good or it like won't count. It's really weird. Here he goes. 
Alright, that's the first three levels. Yeah, I didn't do very good. I got excellent. 